Okay. So you're not going to provide your identification? Can Do you I have your to? Name? Do I have to? I just asked you to. What legal obligation am I? What? Right now, sir, you're under investigation for mischief and public mischief and causing disturbance. And I'm asking you now to provide your name and date of birth. Okay. Yeah. And if you choose not to do that, then yes, I will be arresting you. For okay. Well, I can't give you that because. Okay. Uh, because why? Uh, well, in this day and age, when people that work for government agencies misuse people's personal private information. So right now, you're under arrest for obstruction. Okay. So again, I'm going to ask you, sir, do you want to provide your name? Because the reality of it is I can't release you until yep. I know who you are. Okay, I can't provide any of that unless I've been lawfully arrested. You have been lawfully arrested. Okay. Uh, you are now under arrest, so you can actually just go down that way. Okay. okay. I'm going to take your phone. I'm going to take your phone for now. You, you can try. <laughs> you, sir, I'm asking you for your phone. You're under arrest now, okay? Okay. Are you going to hand your phone What over? am I under arrest for? Obstruction. Okay. Obstruction? Okay. Is that a secondary charge? Okay, my bag's over there by that lamppost, and I'm actually getting quite dehydrated, just so you know. That's fine. Is there identification in your bag? I'm not carrying any, any identification. Okay. No. Once, once I'm of the belief that I've been lawfully arrested, you I will provide that. You already have been lawfully arrested. Okay. I don't believe you. Okay. I'm not going to just screw on down this way. We'll go to the right. On for one second. Does this come off? I'm sure it's still on. That's fine. Okay. I don't have any weapons on me. I know you don't. I'll take your word for it, sir, okay? Well, I, just, I know where it went. Okay. Take this off. Now, you don't need to take that much off. Okay. And the bolt came off here. I don't want you losing your bolt. I'm going to put this back together. Okay, you can go now. Take it down the bolt. Okay. Head down this way, sir. Jones, please, sir. Go ahead, take me. Would you like to be handcuffed? I don't want to go on your property. I don't want to go on your property. Well, sir, you're under arrest now, so I'll do it. That's his bicycle. Okay, well regardless, you said that is his gear. Yeah, yeah. Actually, if it's not locked down, I'll take you to. Yeah. Oh, you don't need me to take it now? No, it's okay. It's not locked down. Okay. But I will ask you, sir, please don't film our building. Okay, it's a security issue, and I'll have to fill out a security report the same thing can happen to you, okay? Yeah, filming, okay. filming our filming the street is fine. Filming yeah. a government building in lieu of certain events nowadays requires a security event in uh, the briefing to be put in. And he refused to identify himself. And because of that, it causes me alarm. So that's why he was arrested. Okay. okay. I understand and, that, right? Well, well I, I don't understand what I'm saying. I ask you, like, what do you mean? What's this? Uh, you have to file a security briefing nice request? And simple. When somebody yeah. videotapes a police building and police vehicles, I have no idea why they're doing it. Yeah. It's a security event. It's a security incident. I have to report that. Yeah. Okay? You understand yeah. that? Well, I understand you know, what you're saying for sure, yeah. Okay. So please don't videotape our office. What's that? Please don't videotape our office. I'm not. I'm walking. Only you can. I'm still over here. Yeah. Here's you, you told me to come over here. Right. Okay. Yeah. You can videotape our office from the front. That's not a problem at all. But yeah. this is technically... Uh, Personal vehicles here, civilian employees. I, I hear you. I was standing over there, not filming here. You told me to come over here and hit the bag and. I'm not sure if I turned off.
straight down the tape. Can somebody get my bag? He's gonna deal with that. I'm gonna have Okay, he doesn't know what's there though. He doesn't know what's there though. He just told him he heard you. Okay. I'm gonna get Where you am I? continue down the Okay. I need my bag though. I'm also getting really dehydrated right now. Follow this around. And just, here. just to make sure I'm, I'm not clear, I'm not free to leave. When you're under arrest, you're not free to leave. That's correct. Okay. What happened to this car? Can you just give a, a verbal reminder though about my bag? Thank you. Just so you know, my shoes are untied. Or one of them is. So if you can give me an opportunity to tie that up, that'd be great. Shoes are probably going to be coming off here in just a minute, actually. Understand. I understand. Bravo 50, uh, just a reminder about the bag there that was mentioned on the sidewalk. Thank you. I appreciate that. See the call is off too. Okay. <laughs> so I have been arrested? Have a seat on the uh, bench for a second, please. Okay. Go ahead and kick off your shoes for me. Okay. All, all of your possessions are going to go up here. Yeah. They'll all be documented in the county. Okay. So I have been arrested? I don't know. Did you hear him say that? I think that you understood you've been under arrest and you said unlawful. Thank you. Well, I believe so. If you want, I can uh, I'm gonna talk over now. 
It's uh, 304. No problem. It's having some computer issues here, Scott. Very welcome, sir. I'm in order. Yeah, I'm in Is, is this an arrest and release or am I going to be held in custody? 
my partner is going to have a look and uh, we'll have to confirm a few things before we can make a, a, that determination. Because first of all, we need to identify 100% who you are. I don't have a problem with that, now that I've been arrested. I know, you're telling me who you are, but how do I confirm that? And there's certain things that we might need to talk about to confirm that, since there's no ID available. Okay, well, and that, that goes a little bit of, uh, down the right path in terms of trying to confirm who you are. So we'll get to that. So if we can confirm ultimately who you are and confirm that, of course, there's no other or any warrant or anything like that, that helps solve the riddle. I may have no idea. No? Okay. Have you been doing media stuff for a while or what were you doing before that? Um, well, I've been making uh, short films and, and, and I've been into photography since 2010. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So you understand what kind of atmosphere are looking But in the loop of the world nowadays, when people are videotaping our office, we have to take it seriously. And I understand that you have a point to make and you feel like as a citizen you're allowed to do this, but that's weighed against other security issues, right. safety of other people, safety of the people that work in this building, the personal information of the municipal employees and the civilians that work in this building. Okay. I know you probably want to be a champion for something, but we're not your enemy. I never said you were. No, but you're, acting, you're, you're, you're acting adversarial with us, and I don't understand why. No. You're not providing your information. Because I'm informed? You're not informed, sir. Okay. Well, that's your See, the truth is, and as Council of Corporal Jones is probably advised, until we can identify you, we can't even release you. Yeah, well, I've already, I've already provided that. I'll provide it. Oh, you, you have to provide your information? Well, he, he mentioned his name very quickly uh, a few minutes ago. I'm going to ask that that happens in a minute again. I'll provide but, it as many times as you need. But, but as I mentioned, you understand that you have a driver's license, great, and there's ways we can start to work to try to confirm who you are, but it sure goes a long way when you actually can hand out some ID. And if you can't do that, then we have to take a little bit more time here to be thoughtful about what we're doing. To and ensure you don't have warrants, that there's not some other order that you've been given by the court. And sir, just so you know, that's 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 worried, I don't want to infringe on your rights any more than you've already forced me to. But we actually have the authority to fingerprint you, to send your fingerprints off to try to determine if you have a, a fingerprint record. Well, to I'm identify you for process the purpose of identification. Yeah. I'm aware really that you can do whatever you want. Yeah. But it's not gonna I mean you can fingerprint if you want, but I'll definitely provide my ID. Okay, good. That's perfect. And then then I don't have to. Well, you're one thing to do. I'm not trying to be adversarial, but you have to understand that what you've done is you put me in a place on purpose to do this. Well, I'm just updating pictures of oh, a police office. Yeah, if you notice. Yeah. If you need my identity. Did your notice say that you'd be taking a uh, video of our secure back parking lot? Yes. Did it say that? Even though that's not even official notice. Official notice uh, has your, it doesn't have a name on it. Right. It has nothing. It doesn't have to. Well, for us it does. Okay? So does it say our secure our compound? It's your opinion. It's fine. <laughs> Property built in vehicles. Okay. Yeah. Well, very, very, that's here. You want to just sign it and it's list, uh, actually, I have a picture of Yeah. Anyways, whatever you need. Uh, um, sir, what's your last name? So, sir, yes, sir, your phone, um, I can't turn it off. Will you turn it off? Power off now? Otherwise, it's just going to die. That's fine. You don't want to turn it off? No. Okay. Um, what's your address, sir? And where is that? Let's see. Victoria, British Columbia. What's your occupation? What's that? 
City of Birth? I, I require that for this book. Uh, no, all, all and it also you comes know. back to us being able to identify who you are. Yes. yes. So, so again, I'll ask you, what was your city of birth? All I require from you is my name, address, and date of birth. If, you, if you're not up to speak, uh, check out the meetings. So it is 29 positive. Uh, first, we have a tent for me. So Dan's been arrested. So this actually three. I think it's all actual level three because I mean they seized his equipment. And uh, I'm just gonna go down in the shade here. And uh, he, the officer was just lying and bullying with uh, fake laws.